it's clearing up. Edward, switch to single sideband modulating. Can you hear me? Edward, switch over to the Hartley modulator. Do you copy? See now. How's this? Oh, 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 that's done it. Edward, what's going on there? We're under attack. They're inside the building. Inside? Can you keep them out of the basement? I'm trying, Jack. I I've never seen raiders that... Listen, if they're inside the building, you have to go to the office and shut down the elevator. You can't risk them getting to Lorenzo. Got it. Office. Elevator. You better round up whoever you can and get... Hello? Edward? Come in. Edward! Ah. There's no signal at all. I've lost him. What's happening, Jack? If these people are inside Parsons, if they free him... Don't worry, I'll handle it. I always knew it would end this way. I never should have allowed you to lock up Lorenzo in that place. That isn't helping, Mother. And as I recall, using the serum was your idea, not mine. So what are you going to do? I said I'll handle it. I'm thinking. Oh. What do you want? What's going on? That was Edward. He's at Parsons, the old asylum. They're under attack by raiders. It's strange. The guards have held off raiders before without any trouble. I don't know what's gone wrong this time. I found Emma Jean. She's fine. Oh, yes. Good. Thank God. At least one small comfort on this terrible day. You'll be wanting to be paid, of course. Edward usually handles these things. Caps is what you use for currency, isn't that right? Here. I hope that's the right amount. Now, we really need to focus on the current emergency. How can you be so callous about your sister's safety? I wonder if these could be the same raiders that stole that last shipment. If some of them had used the undiluted serum, it could explain their unusual success against Edward's men. What exactly does this serum do? I suppose it's time you knew. The main benefit of the serum is to halt aging. My family and I are all over 400 years old. But it also confers other... side effects, especially in the undiluted form that the raiders stole. It increases strength and resistance to all kinds of physical damage. So at least some of these raiders may be much more dangerous than the ones you're used to dealing with. If you're 400 years old, then you were born before the Great War. Yes, I think you were too. I'd say... mid-21st century? That's right. I was in cryosleep until recently. Interesting. We'll have to talk more about that later, but time presses. Is there anything else before we get going? I think it's time you told me what's really going on at Parsons. You're right. It's past time you knew. Jack, are you sure it's wise telling him all this? My father, Lorenzo Cabot, is confined in Parsons. He became dangerously unstable after handling an artifact he found on an archaeological dig in Arabia. He gained various seemingly paranormal powers, as well as becoming increasingly irrational and violent. In the end, I had no choice but to confine him, for his own safety, as well as ours. In the course of my attempts to cure him, I discovered that the artifact had introduced anomalies into his blood. So the source of his insanity is also the basis of the treatments that have prolonged all our lives. The irony isn't lost on me, but if he were to escape from Parsons, I would lose my father forever. I will not allow that to happen. Not to mention that the artifact has made him paranoid, homicidally violent, and endowed with extraordinary abilities. We'd better get to Parsons right away, then. Exactly right. Before we go, I need you to understand something. When we get to Parsons, you need to do exactly what I tell you. Nothing more, nothing less. Is that clear? Got it. Good. 
Make sure you have whatever you'll need for a serious battle. I'll wait for you outside. Jack, be careful. And try not to hurt him. I love Father at least as much as you do. But you know as well as I do that if he gets free, there will only be one option. Don't let it come to that, please. I'll do my best, Mother. And if Imogene finally comes home, for God's sake, don't let her leave again until I get back. Now I really do have to go. I don't need anything right now, thank you. Ready? Let's go. Just to be clear, under no circumstances can we allow Lorenzo to be freed from Parsons. I would have lost my, my father forever. I refuse to let that happen after spending so long trying to cure him. the artifact that's made Lorenzo so dangerous. I'm sure his psychosis would be cured if it could be removed. But so far, all my attempts have failed. It's fused too tightly with his nervous system. I'm well aware of the apparent conflict of interest in my father being the source of the treatment that is prolonging my own life. But I assure you that if I had the chance, I would gladly give it all up to have my father back, even for a short time.
Oh! <laughs> 
Edward's men seem to have given a good account of themselves, but not good enough, sadly. We need to get to my office. From there, we can see how bad things really are. Okay, stick close, follow my orders, and I'm sure everything will be fine. Let's go. blocked from the other side somehow. We'll have to find a way around. I can't believe this is gonna be worth the trouble. Look at this place. Nothing but dust and junk. Uh, huh? This is it's my problem! I trust that. <laughs> I hope Edward is all right. Edward! How badly are you hurt? I'm not dead yet, but I don't think I can get up. You kept them from using the elevator? Yeah. Yes. I... I sent the elevator down to the basement like you wanted and shut it down. Good. Shot quite a few of them before they decided to leave me alone in here. Yeah. <sighs> Haven't seen anybody for quite a while. I think. It's hard to keep track of time. Are you sure you can't get up? I could really use your help. Yeah, Jack. I'm pretty damn sure. Well, then don't worry about it. Me and your friend here will have to take care of things ourselves. They've definitely reached the basement. Although I don't understand how they knew how to get past it. It doesn't matter now. We'll have to go through the abandoned part of the building. It looks like the Abremelin field is still functioning. Although several of the security doors in the basement have already been breached. We'd better hurry if we want to stop them. They seem determined to reach Lorenzo for some reason.
Got it. Let's go. Just follow my instructions and everything will be fine. Be careful, Jack. You too. Who's there? Huh? Keep your eyes open! We never used this wing. Nobody's been in here for decades. No telling what we'll run into. What a mess. Let's hope we can find a way through. The utility elevator is on the bottom floor. I'm coming to Come see on. what that was. So Hey! If you're like, what the? I don't know. Like he ever tells us anything. Whatever. Find you. Leave me alone. Who? Oh. I don't Not care if you're exactly already dead. Push up. You were so. <laughs> Playing oh, games God. with me, huh? Dead already. <laughs> <laughs> 
Good. The old utility elevator is still working. This... come on. This is the only way down. Everyone you see, don't hesitate. We can't let them release Lorenzo. Idiots are trying to shut down the Abremelin field. That's the only thing keeping Lorenzo from breaking out of there. We need to get in there and stop them. Hello, Jack. It's been a long time since I've had the pleasure of a personal visit. Father, I will stop this. My powers have grown, Jack. The artifact still has so much to teach me. Once I am free, I will be happy to teach you too. No, I can't let you out until I can remove the artifact. Let me see. Lucifer's balls. They've locked down all the security doors. I'll have to open them one by one from here while you work your way down the hallway. Quickly now. That's right. You need to shut down the containment field in order to open the door. Shit, they're breaking through the security doors. Hurry it up! I'm opening the main door. That's it. Hurry. Just keep turning. Counter clock. This is going to be fun. Apparently. Even the simplest <laughs> task was beyond your <laughs> My strength returning. Now I will finally be free. One I just need a moment to enter the failsafe cult. We can still stop him if you act quickly. <laughs> it's not too late. It will take some time for him to regain his powers. We still have a chance to stop him. Don't listen to my son. He's the crazy one. Hell yeah. You know this. Look at what he's done to me. I built a failsafe into the containment grid. Switched the four Abremelin generators to manual override, and I can flood his cell with a lethal dose of Zeta radiation. Do the right thing. 
Open this door, and let me out. As soon as you set the Abremelin generators, I can end this. Yes! Now set the other three generators, and I can end this. Now just set the last generator, and I can end this. I think there's still time. That's it! Don't worry, the Zeta radiation won't harm you. I'm sorry, Father. I did everything I could to avoid this. I believe I was close to finding a way to remove the artifact. Liar! Get upon me here forever if you'd had your way, puny worm. <laughs> Do you truly think you have the power to destroy me? <laughs> Good. Goodbye, Father. Excuse me. We didn't have any other choice, did we? What would he have done if he'd gotten free? Oh, he would have killed both of us. And then the rest of my family. And that would only have been the beginning. His crimes, back when he was free. It was only because of my family's influence that he ended up here, rather than on death row. The world now. It's a world made for monsters. Nothing could have stopped him. No. I've answered my own question. We truly had no choice. I'm sorry about Lorenzo. Thank you. I appreciate that. Before you go, I couldn't have done this without your help. I think this is fair compensation. I won't be needing your services after this. Great. Thanks. One more thing. I've done so much research on the artifact. I may be able to do something with it. Come back and see me at Cabot House in a week or so. All my research may not have been completely in vain. <laughs> 